Oh, there you are, YouTube. Doo -loo -doo -loo -doo -loo -doo -loo -doo. Subscribe. We're going to do a random ranking where I pick three movies from my movie collection at random and then rank them from most favorite to least favorite. So let's get to picking some movies. Where is an area I don't pick from? Um, okay, I'm just going to pick right here. I got a tiny glance of what was here, but hopefully I'm not picking one that I just saw because I do want this to be random. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. There we go. One of them has not been opened. Okay, and then I got two slips. Okay, let's see what we got. Now, if I have not seen these movies, we'll, we will replace them. Okay, oh, 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 this is funny. Um, not so random. So my collection used to be in alphabetical order back when it was upstairs. And then I moved it downstairs, and now it's in this weird semi-alphabetical order. Some of it is, some of it is not. But what just happened uh, is pretty interesting. I picked all three new Planet of the Ape, Apes movies. So this is the first time we've had an entire, an entire franchise, not a full franchise because, you know, this isn't like back to the Charlton Heston ones, but of the new Planet of the Apes movies, we have an entire, <laughs> entire franchise. This has never happened. This is the first time in random ranking history where I am doing this. So, um, I mean, I think I had, I'm taking the plastic off here, I think I had planned, like, to make an entire video ranking these, you know, like, finding franchises and then ranking them, so I guess this is happening now, but done in an impromptu method, like, I haven't, there hasn't been any thinking here, how am I going to do this, so, I think I have a favorite ranking and a best ranking here looking at it with a more critical eye and i'm gonna to have to try and blend those two and i think the way i blend them okay yeah i know how i'm gonna blend them okay okay i know what i'm gonna do okay so here we go i already know how i'm gonna rank these i'm gonna start with Rise of the Planet of the Apes, the original, the very first one from this trilogy is going to be number one. I just love this movie. I love that it is not overly serious. Like the, I think the, the third one might be that way. Uh, the second one inches towards that direction. But this one here, I feel like is blockbustery. It's like a blockbuster and smart. I'm not saying blockbusters aren't smart, but it just felt elevated, I guess. I don't know. A bit elevated, but also not at the same time. It was just like great sci-fi, you know. And then what we were seeing here with Caesar was fantastic. All the all the apes, all that um, motion capture that was going on. Is that the right term for it? Still motion capture? I don't know. Whatever that, you know, avatar technology is or whatever, that that's happening here, um, and then visual effects artists working over those those actors, absolutely fantastic. And then, I think I'm gonna have to go for War of the Planet of the Apes. Extremely serious, which I think makes it a difficult watch. This is a very tough film, I think. And the artistry only gets better in this franchise. Like when we're looking at Caesar and the apes, they are like, we thought this was good, and then it was like, oh my goodness, I can't believe this. Um, and, what, I'm trying to think. Steve Zahn, it, it has, like, a, a character, a, an ape in this, and, and he was, he was great. He could, he had speech abilities. I, okay, I, yeah, this is, I just think, so, when I talk about the best versus favorite. This is, I think, the best one. I think War is the best one, but it's a difficult watch. It's hard to watch. Um, it's dark. It's sad. I just, it's not one that I can just be like, yeah, I'm going to watch this movie. I'm going to put this in. So this one, I think, is exceptional filmmaking, exceptional story, archetypal, biblical, but it's not as fun as this one, right? And then this one, I just kind of feel like I like it. 
um, it's kind of rough too. It's very rough as well. But I don't know, it just kind of sits on its own a little bit for me. I do like it. The artistry is amazing. But I think this is a trilogy where we don't have a bad movie in it. This is one of the greatest trilogies, I think. Uh, I'm sad that it feels a little forgotten. But I think the reason is, is because these are some hard movies to watch. So it's not, they're not like fun watches. I would say this one's the fun one. These are... <laughs> Are, are difficult watches and, and kids can't watch them really at least these two um, they, they just don't feel like a movie f from zero to you know 99 so yeah this is my ranking right here rise of the planet of the apes then war for the planet of the apes then dawn of the planet of the apes that's my ranking so basically that's the first movie then the third movie, and then the second movie there at the end. What do you think of this franchise? I think it is fantastic, and like I said, one of the greatest trilogies ever made, right? I don't know. That Those are big words right there, and I haven't seen every movie. But I think it is a fantastic trilogy. I wish it got more recognition. Maybe it's getting it, and I'm just not in the right circles. Um, but yeah, fantastic. And as you can see, I hadn't opened this one and I hadn't opened this one it still has the plastic on it. it's because who wants to watch them there there are some movies that are just so good and difficult that you can't really go back easily like Melancholia I think is one of the best movies I've ever seen ever and I've only seen it once I just don't know if I can return to it um it, it's just not that kind of movie I I just, I won't go back. And these I can see myself going back eventually, but they're not easy watches. You can't just put them in. I can't anyway. Very difficult uh, for me and animals. Um, I wasn't always that way, but movies with animals are very tough for me. Um, okay, so yeah, this is my ranking. Rise of the Planet of the Apes, War for the Planet of the Apes, Dawn of the Planet of the Apes. I never remember the names. So... Uh, have you seen these movies? And if so, what do you think of them? And if you've seen all three of them, how would you rank them? This is, again, a big deal. This has never happened before on Random Ranking. Uh, Pure Hangouts, Random Ranking. Um, and on that note, let me, know, let me know in the comments below. And perhaps I'll see you tomorrow for more Pure Hangout.